it's like exhilarating. I almost cried. I accomplished something that I was scared to do. Go ahead and discuss with your groups why she chose that point, first person point of view. So it's like she was retelling the story to herself. At Ida B. Wells, we are trying to redo middle school. My focus is allowing children to discover their own learning so they feel powerful to go on and try it without a teacher. Walter, you started us off. Give me a high five. I love that. Someone add on. My name is Chago Zemanjoku. I want to be a computer hardware or software engineer. She's a very good child. She loves hard questions. She go over and over and over and make sure. I really like science and math because I watch a lot of superhero movies. Superheroes, there's a lot of stuff about like energy, and I thought that was really cool, so I decided to make physics a career for me. He's been talking about being a scientist since he was two, three years old. When we're at home, he doesn't really like to go out in the neighborhood and play. It's a dangerous world, but I would like for him to get outside more. So teaching in an urban setting, it's difficult for my students to have opportunities to go outdoors. I was called by National Park Trust and Buddy Bison, and they said, can we take your kids out to visit national parks? I just thought it was another field trip, but it became so powerful and much more than that. A lot of times people don't feel like the outdoors is accessible because they don't know where to go. The National Park Trust is a supporting partner of the National Park Service, and I get to do awesome things like work with brands like Hydroflask, coming up with creative ways how we get young people connected to the outdoors. My name's Tim, and I'd like to welcome you all to Carter Rock. You all excited to do some rock climbing today? Yeah! I'm excited to be able to go rock climbing. So we step into them. It's giving me a chance to like try something that I've never actually done before. Let's go! It's really easy to open a book and learn about nature, but it's not the same thing unless our students experience it. There's a beer. We've been working with hundreds of schools across the country, providing outdoor experiences and park field trips to kids that might not have the opportunity to do that. When I'm inside, there's like rules. So when I'm outside, it's like I can just step back and like take a breath. That's really tall. I feel adrenaline. When you're rock climbing, we always want to have three points of contact. I'm ready. Yeah. It's scary. Nice. Off the ground. I can't get up. This is hard. Let's go, Debra. Let's go. I was going up and I thought I couldn't do it. I wasn't really scared of falling, because what I was really scared of was not making it to the top. Let's go. When I looked down, I was like, that's how far I climbed. It's like, exhilarating. Going up a rock climbing wall and being able to come back down, you can show who you really are. We're very proud of you. All of us are. I feel good because I feel like accomplished. Because I never thought because I'd like to do something like this. Look at you. It looks like you're flying. Like, who does that? That's amazing. Let's go. I'll lead you far. I pushed myself beyond past the limit. Now that I did it, it's like, when can I go again?